shad tubes, minnow tubes, soft plastic grubs. Get serious about trout and landlocked king trolling with serious soft plastics from the Fish Hunt Shoot Production Store. Howdy folks, Kel Kellogg here. It is time for that segment we call the Lure Matchup, where I match up two iconic lures and tell you which one I think is best. Today, going head to head is the standard three inch curly tail grub, just like that firecracker grub right there, versus the ever deadly tube bait, just like that minnow tube right there. They're both soft plastics. Fish hit them and they hang on. They feel real and uh, they are both, you know, fish killers. I'm going to have to give the edge to the curly tail grub today, however. Um, the grub is just more versatile than a tube. You could fish them naked, you know, the tail, it gives it action. You could fish them with a dodger. You could fish them with flashers. You could fish them in a creek. You could fish them in a lake they flat out catch fish. You could put them on a jig head and catch trout while casting or while jigging them ver uh, you know, vertically. Um, on the other hand, the tube, the tube is kind of semi one dimensional. To get action out of the tube, you pretty much have to team it with a dodger. Not that great for creek fishing, not that great for casting. You could put a hook in it, you could put a jig head in it and fish it that way, but it's just not gonna have a lot of action. Sometimes that's good, the subtle action is good sometimes, but day in, day out, if I had to choose one over the other, I would choose the curly tail grub. It just has more action and more versatility. Your opinion may vary, but that's my take on these two iconic trout lures. I will catch you next time right here on YouTube.